Hello everyone and welcome to the YoshiCast. I'm Yoshi and on today's episode we're going to talk about gifts for that special comic book collector in your life. Yoshi! Welcome back everybody and on this episode I have put together the top three things I use the most in my comic book collecting for this gift guide and I hope it'll benefit you as much as it's benefited me. Now the very first thing I've got for you, this thing has changed my life in 2018. I am so happy I stumbled across this and I use this all the time. In fact, I don't go to the comic book store without it and that is a comic book folio. Now I don't know many comic book collectors that actually have one of these things and I love this thing. I walk into a comic book store, as I'm picking up the new books off the shelf, I'll throw them in my folio. As I'm digging through back issues, I'll throw them in the folio. And this thing just makes sure your books are not going to get damaged. I absolutely love it. You can, you can easily put your books in and out, take them out at the cash register to, to pay for them and whatnot. The number of comics this thing holds depends on whether they're bagged and boarded and what bags and boards are being used. I can fit 10 books in here, give or take and uh, it's, it's suited my needs. I love this thing so much, it goes with me to comic conventions. Uh, it just, I can throw my books in here, put them in my bag, I don't have to worry about them getting damaged. This thing's not gonna let your books get hurt. Uh, I've dropped books in here, I've had my bag kicked while this thing is in here. This thing is a tank. So I'll go ahead and include a link down below to where you can get this on Amazon, or if you wanna support your local comic book store, uh, mine carries them, I assume a lot of comic book stores carry them, so uh, go check this thing out. I love this thing. I absolutely love it. So the second item I've got here on my gift guide for the comic book collector in your life, bags and boards. Comic book collectors cannot have enough bags and boards. I go through a ton of them. The collectors I know go through a ton of them. It's just part of the hobby. Now these are E. Gerber My Lights and Fullback Boards. This is the creme de la creme when it comes to bags and boards. These protect against sun. These are stronger than your average bags and boards. And uh, you don't have to replace them as often. Your normal bag and board, I'm under the understanding that you have to replace them every five to 10 years. These go 100 years before you're gonna have to work them. These are archival grade. You can talk to anybody that's into genealogy and collecting that kind of thing. Like, this is what you use, and this is what I use with my comics. These are, these are the high-end things. These are the best ones, in my opinion, and you pay for that. These are more expensive than your average bags and boards. A comic book collector is thrilled with bags and boards. This is icing on the cake. This is a Christmas gift. This is a birthday gift. These are awesome. Um, I'll conclude links to the ones and the sizes I use down below. And uh, if you got any questions, just let me know. I'll do my best to answer them as quickly as I can. And that moves on to my final item I've got for you for this holiday gift guide for the comic book collector in your life. And that is gift cards. Go to the comic book store and buy a gift card for them. It's really hard to know what a comic book collector is after or how much money something, especially an older book, is gonna cost. You may go in looking for a book and then get sticker shock and not wanna do that. And that was your only idea that's, that's, that's rough. Get them a gift card. They, we've all, us comic book collectors are always buying books. We're always looking at how to morph our collection or what we wanna read or, or some other thing we need in the hobby like bags and boards or portfolio. Let them decide, get them a gift card. Uh, I've gotten them in the last year and it, it's awesome. It's, it's great to know that somebody understands that I love this stuff but doesn't know where to go with it. So a gift card is fabulous. Like that's, that's, that's one of those things you can't go wrong with for the comic book collector in your life. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope, uh, I hope you thought, found this useful and helpful. And if you've got ideas that you wanna share with what I should have added or what I could add in the next gift guide, throw them down below and, and let's talk about them because I think that's really cool. And until my next video, take care. I'll catch you in the next one.